Now, flashpoints between the BJP and the TMC continue ahead of the Lok Sabha elections. Massive ruckus took place in the presence of BJP's Dilip Ghosh. Dilip Ghosh was participating in a discussion program when a group of people arrived and raised TMC flags and slogans against him. Then, chaos erupted between BJP workers and the police report. Then beyond that, a scuffle took place between the workers of both of the parties, the BJP and the TMC. Now, later on, the police were able to control the situation, and those creating the ruckus claimed that they were there to ask Dilip Ghosh about 10 years of development. Ghosh has since said that some people came to create a ruckus, which is why he doesn't want to speak with them. Now, crossing over to my colleague Shreya to get us more on this. Uh, Shreya, tell us more about what went on. Remember Dilip Ghosh has been filled by BJP for the Bardhaman Durgapur seat. Earlier, he was the sitting MP from Mednipur from where uh, Agnimitra Paul has been filled by BJP this time around. Now, uh, Dilip Ghosh, while he was in Durgapur, fought some, uh, you know, discussion. That is the time when some miscreants came, some men came and tried to speak to the Dilip Ghosh. Slogans were raised. They first uh, claimed that they are not from any political party. Later, they gave slogans and raised flags of the TMP party a ruckus was there now there was a scuffle that broke out between the TMC and the BJP supporters police uh, had to reach the location and then take the situation in control now Dilip Ghosh says that these people are the people who came there with the intention of creating ruckus the very reason why he was not ready to have a conversation with these people now remember this is not the first BJP versus TMC scuffle the scuffle between the worker we are seeing before this also we have seen the scuffle between the BJP and the TMC supporters of Nishit Plamanik and uh, Udayan Guho. Now, this time around, we see the BJP and the TMC workers scuffle related to Dilip Ghosh. Absolutely, Shreya. Thank you so much for joining us and telling us more about this particular situation. Now, making a statement about the overall law and order situation in the state of West Bengal, Dilip Ghosh says that criminals will be punished. <laughs> যখন দরকার হবে চোরেদের বাড়িতে ইডি সিবিআই যাবে এনআইএ যাবে যারা রাষ্ট্রদ্রোহী যারা দেশে বোম বন্দুক নিয়ে কারখানা করছে বোম ফাটাচ্ছে মানুষকে মারছে বিদেশের সঙ্গে হাত মিলিয়েছে তাদেরকে মাটির তলা থেকে বার করবে এই আমাদের কেন্দ্র সরকার কেউ বাঁচবে না ছিলেন ওনাদের বিজেপি লোক ওনারা আমাদেরকে ছিলে ফেলে দিচ্ছেন নীতিমতো